Now you've made your character, what we need to do is set up some code to get things to work. So when the user clicks the flag to start the game, we want our character to be situated somewhere on this um, out here. Um, so we need it to go to a certain position. And uh, if you move your character around here, you'll notice these positions update and it'll also tell you the position down here. 0, 0 is in the middle, so it's using x, y coordinates, so x is going left and right, y is going up and down. So we're going to just get that character to go to 0, 0, and we're going to get another one of those um, events, and that will be a key. So we're going to get w, a, S, D to control the character and make it go up. So X, Y go up and down. So we'll just get motion here and you can get the character to go up and down and by changing the Y coordinates. And so Y positive is up, Y negative is down. So you should then be able to right mouse click and dupl duplicate that block and change that to S, which is going down. So just go. And then same thing that will right mouse click and duplicate and we'll get A and D we'll get rid of those Y's because we want that to be on the X axis left and right so X axis X axis now when it goes um, down um, the character goes down it's a negative Y so we'll just make that minus 10 now you can change the increments, like how far, um, instead of 10 it could be 5 or 2. It really depends on how, how much detail is going to work for you in your, your game. So there you have it. Um, now I'll just quickly find a space scene. Now our character here, um, when we hit the flag, is going to the center, and when I hit W, it goes up, D, oop, oops, so I didn't change those. S, A, to the left, good. So hit the flag, and it should just go left, right, up, down.